So today's battle is between the African praying mantis and the Hercules beetle. So yeah, let's get started. So the Hercules beetle could be up to five to six inches long. Yeah, that's it. The African praying mantis, on the other hand, can be up to around. Wait, let's just. Yeah, man, I'm done. They can be up to around. What's 68 centimeters? That's like two inch. Two to three inches long. And some can be up to four inches at most. So yeah. So the mantis's weapons. Okay, let's compare their weapons. Main weapon. The grappling. The long range weapon. So the mantis's raptorial forearms against the, Her the Hercules beetle's pincers. The edge goes to the Hercules beetle's pincers. Yeah, they don't do that much damage. They're usually used for grappling, grappling, throwing other beetles. Up. But they can't. But they have a longer range, and it will usually let used to like fence the praying mantis. I mean, yeah, the praying mantis can just grab it and eat it, but like. Like, dude, this thing is freaking huge. Like, look at this. Dude, I don't think the praying mantis is getting past it without, like, walking it forward. But the beetle would just probably follow it if it's eyesight. Okay, when it comes to biting power, this definitely goes to the praying mantis. The praying mantis usually, usually eats other bugs. Yeah, and the, and the Hercules beetle it eats tree sap and bark. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> okay. Moving on. <laughs> so we see that the Hercules beetle is a lot bigger right now. Okay. We're using the, the maximum length. So a female African pra African praying mantis against the uh, against a male Hercules beetle. Okay. When it comes to speed, the mantis is a lot faster. When it comes to strength, the Hercules beetle is a lot faster. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention that the Hercules beetle's bites when it comes to males, it actually can be pretty painful to humans, but I don't know for bugs. I don't know for bugs though. Brains, they're not really smart. But I, if I gotta say it, I think the mantis is a little smarter. More aggressive mantis, and then the beetle is more defense. Okay, let's fight. They're both 10 inches away from each other, and they're in bloodlust mode. So, this type of African praying mantis has hunted beetles before, and, and he sees his freaking beetle a little bigger than him, but he can take it. So, he grabs the freaking beetle's like top pincer and starts biting into it. So he he, th he knows it's a weapon. So he bites it to immobilize the freaking beetle. But the beetle fights back and actually kind of flings the mantis away a couple centimeters. The mantis gets up in a in a, in a intimidation pose, spreading its wings while standing up on its four legs and then raising its arms in the air. The beetle the beetle stands on its hind legs too, but like. Like, um, it's just like, like, you know, it just stands on its four legs, but the the other front two, it's just like wiggling around. Yeah, even, so the beetle does the same as Mantis, kind of, and it turns out to be a little bigger because of his freaking horn pincer. And the Mantis kind of backs down, but this, but, but the Mantis strikes and, and grapples to the man, the beetle's front legs. Both of the beetle's front legs. And then bites into the soft underbelly of the beetle. And this is where the beetle's at the most vulnerable. Because he can't get up. Uh, and he can't get back up. 
from his back, you know. And plus, the 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 body armor is at the fr- is, the, is at the top, you know. So yeah, he's just biting down. The Hercules beetle, though, he's lucky. And apparently, the mantis is like the mantis lets go for some miraculous reason. This is when the beetle gets into sicko mode and just bites the mantis with its pincers, shakes him around. The mantis like finagles his way into biting the the beetle's face and eyes. He gets to chopping and bites off one of the the beetle's eyes. The beetle lets go and like he like. He's like confused, disturbed. So they both look at each other, trying to intimidate the other. Before the beetle just walks off, he doesn't want to fight anymore, and so does the mantis. The mantis climbs the tree, and and the uh, Hercules peels just goes back into the bushes, into the lawn grass. Yeah, but anyway, this fight ended in the draw. But who do I think would win? Well, if I had to choose a winner, it would probably be the the African praying mantis. I think he will win around 52% of the time. It will be a really close fight, though. So, yeah, but who do you think would have won this fight? Tell me in the comments below. and what fight do you want me to do? Make sure to subscribe, like, turn on notifications, share. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.